hello friends in this video i will show you how to show a list in a dialog box and select one of the items from the list so this means i will show a traditional single choice list in dialog box so this is my activity main and it contains a constraint layout and inside this it has a button and a text view you can see in quotes there is a constraint layout inside this there is a text view for which i have set the bottom left right and top constraint the text size is 25 dp and text is hello world now for the button it has all these four constraints the text is pick fruit text size 25 dp now we have to set id for this button so i will set it as button 1 earlier it was button and for the text view also i will set the id to text view 1 so this seems fine but this id is used here also so here also i have to make it text view 1 so this is the main.xml which contains a text view and button now we go to main activity.java here i have defined in on create i have defined a button called button1 and it will be from id button1 next i have defined a text view for which the id will be text view1 find view by id r dot id dot text view one after this we set on click listener for button one new view dot on click listener add override public void on click inside this first i will define alert dialog dot builder let's name it as builder is equal to new alert dialog dot builder here i write the activity which is main activity dot this next line i will set the title for this builder builder dot set title this will be pick a fruit and whatever fruit is picked it will be displayed in the text view now i have to create a list of fruits so here i will create a string array string array means string list and i will name it as fruits fruits list okay this will be equal to these fruits in curly bracket i have put apple mango banana pineapple cherry guava and papaya all these are separated by a comma now in the end there will be this semicolon now in the next line I will set the items for the builder. So here I will write builder dot set items. Here I will write the fruits list, comma, on click listener for the dialog interface. dialog interface dot on click listener 
okay i have to add it as new dialog interface dot on click listener and i will select it once again so that it will automatically add it new dialog interface dot on click listener at override public wide on click in the end i have to put a semicolon now in on click event this int which this is the position of this list and i can display it in this text view by writing text view dot set text here i have to use this list so i will write fruit list and i have to get the item which is selected so i will put these brackets and the position which this is the position so it will display it in text view display the selected fruit in text view and that's all here now let's check this app So here is the app. When I click on pick fruit, okay, it doesn't display anything. Uh, I have missed this one thing. After this, I have to create the dialog and show it. So in the next line, I will create an alert dialog. Alert dialog. Dialog. Is equal to builder dot create and next line I'll write dialog dot show. Now let's check this once again. So now here is the app. When I click on pick fruit. It displays the title here, pick a fruit, and then it displays the list, all the fruits. When I select anyone, it displays the name of that fruit in this text view. And I can select another fruit from here. Whatever I select, it is displayed in this text view. So that's why in this video. I hope this was useful. Thank you very much for watching this.